city like Calgary, um, that's an oil and gas town, um, and 25% of our city is business tourism. So we look at it from a tourism perspective, that's a pretty big chunk of your business. Um, so we watch very carefully what an oil and gas industry does, but the 75% of our business that isn't is where we really live. And you know, it's not seeing, it's not seeing a pullback. And in fact, um, one of the things that we've noticed during any, any kind of a pullback in oil and gas is that our regional marketing starts to really increase. And so particularly when a US dollar goes up to $1.30, everyone thinks that brings tourists up. In some ways it, it reminds you know, Albertans that maybe this would be a great year to stay home and look at the attractions closer to home. And so all kinds of opportunities exist in that space. I see actually some great opportunities for Calgary. Uh, it's at a point to decide what its new attractions are going to look like. Um, as you look at an east development piece connected to stampede lands, connected to other things that we hear about in the space, what kind of new facilities would come to Calgary and how can we as an industry help inform what would be best for a downtown core, what creates vibrancy and life and, and energy in a city. And um, with all the folks that are starting to live in the downtown core, it's changing the face of Calgary. I love our traditions, I love our Western hospitality and the friendliness of Calgary. It is one of our best selling points. But having that robustness of the city, just because people live there, is gonna make a huge difference to how we progress in the future. I've seen the cycle many times. And I do know that as much as we see the downturn, we will see the up again. And yes, you're right, there are difficult times for some folks out there today. Um, my own children are experiencing their very first downturn of economy, but I think I've seen three major waves. We know that it will come and that it'll change and that Calgary will once again be going full tilt. Let's just take the advantage of both sides of the cycle to do what we can to diversify and make it better in the future.